No more changing stations, you came to the right place. Turn off your televisions, they'll just get in the way. It's time to get to the point on 1073. Likes is on the air with locals only. Central Kentucky's Rock Station 1073, the point, locals only. Sunday night, the dumbass Marys. And, and number one, you have to introduce yourself and tell me where the hell that name came from. <laughs> Well, hi, I'm Trent, uh, Trent D. Chi Lantes. Uh, this is... Um, Jonky Devilish Beats Guinea, you know. <laughs> uh, there's uh, not really a story behind that name. We just thought it kind of sounded cool, man. <laughs> kind of sounded like it kind of fit? Yeah. <laughs> just dumbass music, man. <laughs> So just having fun with it and just doing it to be kind of kind of a, something that would stick out there. I mean, obviously, I haven't heard of another band called The Dumbass Mary, so there you go. Well, there actually was one when we Googled it. And really? We said, okay. We said, well, this is such a good name, man. Uh, how, do we, how do we use that? That's why we put the extra E in. Ah, gotcha. <laughs> where, where was the other band that you found that actually had that name? Was it anywhere around here? Uh, no, it was uh, somewhere in Eastern Africa, I think. Yeah, I'm sure you're going <laughs> to cross paths at some point in time and get into a brawl or something. Um, so you guys have been recording some music. Tell us a little bit about the process uh, behind that at this point. Uh, yeah, recently we uh, recorded a few songs down at uh, Pandarilla. Mm-hmm. Uh, good people out there. Uh, James Terry and uh, Sam and Jacob Langley. Good okay. people out there. James is actually my brother. Oh, yes, okay. James's brother. Okay, okay. <laughs> So do you get like a discount or something? I wish. <laughs> <laughs> so he's a punch, we, uh, it, punch it a little bit harder in the gut? Is uh, that what you're saying? Cause yeah, he's your... <laughs> yeah. We kind of uh, traded services. Oh, okay. Everything on the side, Mr. Trinity here, he also has a uh, shirt printing business. Okay. It's a lethal dose. So we kind of traded, you know, services and everything gotcha. like that. Yeah, so. gotcha. If you so. need any uh, anything screen printed, look up uh, lethal dose screen printing on Facebook. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'll, uh, I'll help you out. Okay. Uh, tell us a little bit about the, the band as a whole. How long has the band been together? Uh, well, uh, my brother Eldridge Palmer uh, is, plays bass for us, and mm-hmm. we started recording songs just ourselves and writing uh, about a year ago. Okay. And uh, we were looking for a drummer, and uh, I've known Junkie here since high school and uh, finally got him to come in and start doing some drums for us, and that's kind of taken off from there. Okay. So uh, what kind of direction do you look for the band to go at this point? You've written a couple songs so far. Um, you know, are you writing some more right now? How does, how does that creative process work? Uh, well, we, we, are, we try to keep writing constantly, uh, and we're really uh, focusing on our live shows right now. We've got a show coming up September 21st okay. at uh, Union Station. Uh, that's in uh, Louisville. Louisville. Yeah, Louisville. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you been to Union Union Station? I've been to before. Okay. Yeah, that's. Uh, have you ever been there before? I personally haven't. Okay, okay. I have. Yeah. I've been there. <laughs> yeah. Been there a few times. The country it's, karaoke bar on the one side. Yeah, <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's, pretty, <laughs> it's a very interesting place. So. Yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty cool venue though. I mean, yeah. you've got your one side. Well, it sounds good. The sound's really good so. in there. I'll, 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 every band I've seen in there, the sound has been excellent on that side. It's a. It's a good room to watch. A good intimate room to watch folks play in. So we need good sound. So. <laughs> Tell us a little bit about the first track, Infidel Castro. It's uh, infidelcastro.com. Uh, his lyrics were written by Jonky here, if he wants to say something about that. Well, um, the thing with infidelcastro.com, when I was writing it, I really didn't, you know, it's just got wrote. I really didn't have a premise or anything like that to go on. I just thought it sounded cool, and I was like, hey, I'm going to write a song about this, and just threw a bunch of stuff together, and somehow it kind of made sense, so... You know, and then Mr. Trinity here and, you know, his brother Eldridge, they threw down the bass and the guitar parts, and I did the drums, and it's infidelcastro.com. <laughs> there you go. Let's uh, check it out right here. Infidel Castro, it is locals only, Central Kentucky's rock station. The dumbass Mary's <laughs> Central Kentucky's rock station, 1073 The Point. <laughs>
Central Kentucky's Rock Station 107.3, The Point, Infidel Castro, The Dumbass Marys on Sunday nights, locals only. And uh, do you guys got music online they can check out on the website, that kind of thing? Uh, we sure do. We, uh, you can stream uh, some songs on Spotify uh, for free. Okay. Uh, we've got songs posted on uh, SoundCloud, Reverb Nation, uh, band page on our Facebook. If you go to Facebook backslash Dumbass Music, uh, you'll find us or just... Uh, Search for the Dumbass Marys, and we've got quite a bit of music up. Quite a bit of music up? Yeah. Also, if you actually want to buy the CD, you can go on iTunes, and we're on there, too. Okay, so you're on iTunes. They can buy the CD on there, or they can come out to the show September 21st, 21st at, at Union, Union Station. Station. Okay. Okay. So doing a lot more live shows, is that what you're trying to do out in the fall? Yeah, yeah. We're definitely trying to to get out there and entertain people, meet meet people. So what's as a band? What's what's the I guess uh, the best aspect of being in a band for you is is it doing the live show or is it recording in the studio? I mean, some people like the creative aspects of recording in the studio better than being out live. I I, I personally like a live band. So yeah, I mean, uh, I think it's all pretty pretty good. But yeah, uh, yeah playing live, it's that's awful fun, man. Playing live, you think is the better than sitting there and noodling in the studio oh, yeah. to some degree? Yeah. I like doing both of it, but I have to say I like doing it live better because the people are actually there and you can actually feel the you know feedback from it. Right, sure. And everything because the producer's just going to sit there and tell you, hey, you know, good job. You know, we don't have to do that take again. But if you know you're actually out there and the people are listening to you, they can sure. be like, boo, you suck. Right, and sure, things. sure. So there's like a little bit more feedback there. So you can check out your music if they want to reach you. They can reach you on uh, Facebook, you said? Yeah, right now Facebook is pretty much our official page. We don't have a, our own domain yet, but we're looking at it. So Okay, okay. And they can check you out. Uh, you're going to go back into Pandarella Studios and record some more music at this point? You guys got a couple songs. You got two songs you're, we're working tonight. and uh, I'm not sure that we plan on recording anything real, real soon, but okay. it's definitely on the horizon. Definitely on the horizon. So there's more music online they can check out if they like these two songs, a bunch of other stuff they definitely, can check out. Definitely, yeah. Okay. Well, uh, tell me a little bit about, I got a big thing. That sounds kind of dirty. <laughs> a lot of people think that, but really, yeah, I wrote it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait a second. There's some hidden message here. <laughs> no, it's it's just a little bit more uh, standard fare than, than Infidel, maybe. Uh, it's uh, just your boy-girl stuff, you know? Okay. Uh, really not a whole lot to it. It's just, uh, well, maybe it is kind of dirty now that I think about it. <laughs> <laughs> it's definitely not no love song if that's what you're trying okay, to get it's, at. It's I mean. not a love song. I got a big thing. All right. Well, uh, thank you guys for coming in. I appreciate yeah. it, man. Thank you. The yes, yes. Dumbass Marys. Uh, check them out on iTunes. Go buy their stuff on iTunes. And uh, September 21st, uh, Union Station. I got a big thing. The Dumbass Marys. Check them out on Facebook, too. Central Kentucky. Two E's. Two E's. That's right. <laughs> 107.3 The Point. Locals only.